Good evening, I'm Veronica Vega, and this is a special report from 3Line V News Station. We bring you live coverage of a devastating fire that has struck our community. A massive fire broke out moments ago at a big blue house on Elm Street. The flames are fierce, consuming the structure with an intensity that leaves onlookers in shock. Our brave firefighters are on the front lines, battling the inferno. Their hoses spray water, but the heat pushes back relentlessly. Amid the chaos, our cameraman, Mr. Sensitive, captures every heart-wrenching moment. His lens focuses on the desperate efforts to save lives and property. The situation remains tense, but there's a glimmer of hope. One person has been rescued from the burning house. Paramedics whisk them away, their condition unknown. The victim's identity remains confidential, but we pray for their recovery. Neighbors gather, their faces etched with fear and disbelief. Children clutch stuffed animals, seeking comfort amidst the chaos. The once quiet Elm Street now echoes with sirens, shouts, and the crackling of flames. Authorities are already on the scene, investigating the cause of this devastating fire. Was it an electrical fault? A misplaced candle? We'll keep you informed as details emerge. Our community rallies together. Bottles of water are passed to exhausted firefighters. Strangers offer words of encouragement. The resilience of Maple County shines even in the face of disaster. Thank you for watching the Three Line V News. Until next time, I'm Veronica Vega. This is 3LV News. Here is the latest update by the MPV fire departments on scene. Well, what we believe to uh, have caused the fire is a uh, stove that was uh, turned on, the oxygen was left on overnight, and a uh, spark when the users, um, when the uh, patient had his uh, phone turned on and he plugged in his charger, it sparked, causing a chemical reaction to start the fire. Uh, approximately, maybe like five, six hours at the uh, tops, started at uh, 2.06 a.m. and we are now at, I believe, 8 a.m. if I'm not... Nope, we're at... Oh, actually, it took a little longer than that because it is 1.35. I'm Veronica Vera. And I am John Valensky. Coming to you live with the weekly news that could make you slash e-dance. Thank, Thank you. you.